Hello you guys, um, hello Exposure as well. I just realized I never did an intro or an outro for my videos and then here I am going three inches shorter um, because I forgot. So today I'm doing a little, an well another like get ready with me like date inspo um, video which I'm very 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 excited for because my other one I did a couple weeks ago you guys seemed to really really enjoy so I'm bringing another one back to you guys but instead I'm doing obviously a whole nother look this is a lot more natural i would say um my hair's just in a bun but i brought to you guys three different outfits to choose from instead of just one i brought three different ones and i'm super duper excited so yeah make sure you guys like and subscribe and if you want to follow me on my own <laughs> if you want to follow me on all my other social medias they will all be linked down below and i would love if you guys did but yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and it's a good one i don't know i enjoyed it i enjoyed filming it i think this was like really really fun and it was so simple so Clear. all right guys so um we're using natural lighting today i have lights and i just decided not to pull them out because it's literally early in the morning i kind of just woke up that's why my face looks so white it's 9 49 a.m so it's gonna be very um casual i would say just a little life update i don't know but for starters uh i'm using my clinique uh dramatically different moisturizing lotion and just going into my skin just to prep for all the makeup that will be coming on i did a little get ready with me recently and i wanted to do another one because you guys seem to, to had to have a okay english please you guys seem to have um enjoyed that video so i wanted to bring another one with a little bit more outfit ideas so i will be doing my outfits and thank you dogs for barking bells um i will be bringing a couple more outfits to the table for this one kind of the same but with a little bit more you know um okay so now that i moisturize i need to moisturize my lips because i just woke up and my lips just feel very dry i would say okay thank you okay so we're gonna take no moisturizer because i don't really feel like looking for one right now so i'm going to be taking my mac um but we're taking Max um, Studio Fix Fluid in the shade C 3.5 because I'm like a medium, not even, I'm pretty white. I don't know. So we're going to take that just right onto my fingers with a Real Technique sponge. But you guys have seen my, if you have never watched my videos before, hi, welcome. I'm my Ram. Um, but if you have, I like to take a brush first i will usually go in with my y6 um brush from morphe and then i feel like my hair looks weird and then just rub that all in just blend it all in not blend it but just like smear it all in and then oh i need a prime and then i'll take my real technique sponge and go in with that as well I have so for my primer i'm going to be using this nyx um Photo Loving Primer, uh, it color balances, but I don't know what that means, nor do I know anything about makeup. So, we're going to put a tad bit on our finger, and it's literally like a pea size amount, and just rub that all throughout your face. And, and we'll jump right into the look with some foundation. So I'm taking my C, my MAC Studio Fix, and just... Pouring that on the top of my hand. Well, let's pretend it's not going to be too dark and keep going. Okay, now I'm taking my Y6 and just buffing it all out. Okay, so now that I look one shade and gross, I will take my beauty blender and just blend out any streakiness. Okay, hi hair. Any streakiness that happens to be you know, on my skin. So I will go in with my 
So I will go in just with my Tarte Shape Tape like I always do. I love this concealer. Um, Very, very high coverage. So I only use like a dot or two. As I put it all right there. And then I'll take another, my bead blender again, and just buff it in. So now that that's buffed in, I just like keeping my concealer very controlled. I don't know why it looks so white right now. Hold on. Okay, well now that my hair is up and I look one shade and I also look bald, we are going to set the makeup because we don't want to wait too long. And um, I don't like to bake or anything, to be honest with you guys. Um, like, I'll do it, but, like, I don't really enjoy doing it. I mean, it's fine. So I'll just take a big brush and just, you know, um, which I should be setting my under eyes, but I actually need to get, I don't know, I just don't like setting it, like, with colored or, um, what's the word? I don't know, this, like, translucent, I'm uh, not translucent, this powder isn't translucent, so I don't like to set my under eyes with that, like, non-translucent stuff because i just think it like takes away from the brightness so after i'm done setting my face i will go straight into eyebrows because my eyebrows are kind of dark but i have like very like patchy on my eyebrows so i just like to brush them out with my spoolie first just so i can get like all the foundation or like anything that was on there prior and just brushing them out so they'll be as dark as they are naturally grab my pomade i've done this in like almost every tutorial um recently since i've started using pomade so i'll just do my pomade and my anastasia brush which is in here i think or somewhere so i'm just taking my anastasia 12 brush and my pomade and if you guys want a full-on eyebrow tutorial or how I do my eyebrows, let me know. I will get that done for you guys. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to do my eyebrows off camera and then come back when my eyebrows are back on, you know? So now that my eyebrows are lock and loaded, lock, lock and loaded, oh, sorry, I have music on. Um, I will bronze my face up and I don't carve out my eyebrows or anything. I literally just put pomade on and that's it. But actually, I put gel on my eyebrows but i'll do that later so yeah i'll start by doing some bronzer and i've been using this bronzer forever it's not even bronzer it's literally it's like it's um powder it's powder foundation and lady at nyx like matched me like super incorrectly so it's fine though i it was fine because i enjoy the product still i'm in the shade beige and I just use it as bronzer and it's like it works well. It matches my skin tone. So I'll just go in with that. I don't like to do too much bronzer. I used to really go overboard with the bronzer and use like a dark one too. It was just a mess. So I just like to do super lightly. And then I'm gonna bronze. That's literally all I do for bronzer. And I didn't my makeup, my foundation looks good. My foundation is doing great. You're doing great, sweetie. Um I'll take some blush after that. And since, like, you are going on date night, for more for daytime, I like to use um, Tarte's, like, Royal one. And it's a browner. It's like a brown blush. It has, like, a pink undertone. But since it's, like, a date night thing, you should probably, if you want to, take a pink one. And Tarte's um, bronzers are super, I mean, blushes, are super duper duper uh, pigmented. So I like to take the, because bronzer, I mean, I keep calling it bronzer, but blush like intimidates me, TBH. Um, that's just what happens. But I will usually take it, smile, and right here. Just right there. And right there. And that's really all I do <laughs> for blush. Just add a little bit of like, you know? Um, I think my eyebrows look bad, but I mean, what can you do? Um, let me find my highlight. I used this product once and I never used it again, and then I picked it up yesterday and it legitimately fell in love. I really have to go. I fell in love. So, this is the Glossy Glossier 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 some, Glossy something, um, in the shade quartz quartz oh I'll, I'll link it down below it's literally beautiful i'll just take it right here 
and it's like not powdery so it won't make you look like you just like caked powders and powders and powders on it just melts into your skin it's literally the most beautiful product i have ever ever used can you believe that can you believe her can you believe her so i just like blend that out with my finger and literally call it a day i will take this cloud paint also by glossier glossier cloud paint um in the shade puff and literally you guys okay well let just fell like do not put a lot like literally this much i'll like rub it together with my two fingers and i'll put it on my lips which is like not what it's meant for it's definitely meant for your cheeks as a blush but i don't follow the rules so i just put that on my lips gloss in the shade clear and just put that on top of it um so i will take telescopic and my better than sex mascara and it's like literally name a better duo you can't put the telescopic on first better than sex telescopic better than sex and call it a day so let me put that on because i don't want to bore you guys you know how to put mascara on right so now that my lashes are fully coated i have powder all over my shirt don't mind this this isn't the shirt i'm wearing i'll take my max um max my mac fix plus in just do a couple spritz on my face and then i'll take my ColourPop um brow boss gel and it's this like little white spoolie thing and i will just set my eyebrows with this and it's very natural it's, it's a cute makeup look um and i'll jump right into the outfit so let me show you guys that so this is literally probably one of my favorite outfits so this coat it's literally beautiful it's so crazy um maybe for like more of a super date night <laughs> um but this has like oh it's beautiful it's super long it goes over your shoulders there's a hole right here to put your arms through like just look at the cutout okay well this is from Shein. um i'm obsessed so i'm just wearing this black it's kind of short but i'm just wearing this black dress with it and some little heels so you're really just wearing the coat if you guys just put some like silver or gold jewelry on with this very dainty not too much this okay high exposure oops sorry about my mirror it's also dirty but yeah if you guys just do some very dainty like jewelry very cute this outfit will be killer but this is like the nicer outfit and i have casual and then more casual you know what i mean let me show you some more so this one like this jacket totally changes hello this jacket totally changes like the mood for everything. This is so much more casual, I feel like. So it's just this, this long jacket. I have the same black dress on from before. You guys can literally use any dress. I think a white one would also look very, very, very cute with this. Since the pearls on the shoulders are white, look how freaking cute this jacket is. So yeah, this jacket's super cute. Also, just with the same black heels, same black dress. And then this, this is just an off-the-shoulder thing so you can wear it you can wear this jacket in so many ways if you put some white jeans on white shirt all white since it's now spring too perfect it's literally perfect but yeah so this has little pearls on the side which pearls are really really in right now so that's perfect super long ripped up jean jacket that i'm obsessed with and this is all such nice freaking quality it's unbelievable it's literally unbelievable by the way i will have all of the jackets and all the stuff link down below if you guys want to just get yourself one i don't think they're too expensive especially for the quality of them it's very nice quality so 10 out of 10 for me i really like this outfit okay so this one is a lot this one's a lot more casual i feel like it's just these white jeans with this bodysuit which Literally, if you do not have a bodysuit, please get yourself one. It's the best investment ever. And they're like, you can get such cheap ones like Windsor or something. And then, have I been covering the mic in these? I hope not. Um, with this, like, skin, not skin, this pink ish. Okay, these clothes are like messing with my vibe. Okay. So, this pink ish um, blush colored jacket. And this color, like, not to not to unflex or anything but i'm just joking um is i don't know i like how it looks on my skin tone um this is very cute very casual i'm wearing these same heels okay and i'm just wearing the same heels that i've been wearing in the past three shots but 
I love this outfit. It's super, it's like a lot more casual, maybe for more daytime. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? But yeah. Alrighty guys, so that's pretty much wraps up my video. Um, that's the chair I sit in for my videos. Sorry about that. But yeah, that pretty much wraps up my video. I really have to go. I have practice in like 20 minutes. So I have to go and I still have to get myself lunch. Um, but yeah, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching. I really, really hope you enjoyed this video and all the outfits and everything will link down below. Everything will be linked down below if you guys want to check anything out. It's going to be, I don't know, they're relatively cheap. So, um, they're pretty, they're really cheap actually. So yeah. This is, this is, I love this jacket. You guys can literally ask Isaac how many times I've already worn it and I've had it for like two weeks, so very embarrassing. But yeah, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching. And if you guys liked this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more Get Ready With Me's or just more videos in general, let me know what you guys want to see and I will be down to film. But yeah, you guys, I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much for watching and I will see you again next time.